Regional Testing Day is now a significant part of the Caribbean annual calendar of events, taking place on the last Friday of June every year since 2008. The event started in a handful of just six islands and expanded to over 21 territories with over 70,000 people being tested to date. This is no small achievement for the Caribbean Broadcast Media Partnership that conceptualized Regional Testing Day that is now a media-led initiative to encourage testing as an important means of prevention of HIV infection. As the Ministry of Health will tell you, it is very critical for, for an, any HIV program anywhere that you know your epidemic, you know what your numbers are, and that people who are at risk are comfortable coming forward for testing. Without partners, regional testing day would not be possible, and Scotiabank has shown exemplary commitment since its inception. This is what makes regional testing day so important, and why Scotiabank has been committed to it from the start. Because regional testing day brings HIV testing out into the open. It removes the stigma, it lifts the pressure of having to go out of your way to get it done. The whole point of Regional Testing Day is to make it easy for us to know our status. Support for Regional Testing Day has come from so many of the region's famous people who've crossed the political divide to unite for one goal. At the 2009 Regional Testing Day media launch in Barbados, the late Prime Minister, the Honorable David Thompson, and then opposition leader, the Honorable Mia Motley, were the first to come together to provide leadership and support for the then Young Project. I'm truly thrilled to support this drive, particularly with the success that we have had in Testing Day in Barbados. In 2008, over 1,000 persons in Barbados came forward to be tested for HIV. This remarkable turnout would not have been possible without the able assistance of the media. And therefore, the media must be regarded as an essential partner in promoting the regional and national health and wellness agenda, including HIV awareness and prevention. I therefore commend the Caribbean Broadcast Media Partnership on HIV AIDS. So that I ask today simply, as we stand here in this public commitment, that people recognize that voluntary testing sends a clear and strong message that I am in charge of my life and I intend to take responsibility for it. I refuse to accept the role that is assigned to me to simply be a number, but I am instead a leader and fully take responsibility for my destiny. This type of non-partisan support has continued through the years, with similar support coming from then Jamaica Prime Minister, the Most Honorable Portia Simpson Miller, and Opposition Leader, the Honorable Andrew Holness. Anyone who has the slightest knowledge of Caribbean media will know that the CMP's effort to get 110 media houses from 24 countries throughout the region to design, produce, and distribute a coordinated campaign of radio and television ads reaching tens of thousands of exceeds the description of commendable. I wholeheartedly encourage all of us to support any program which seeks to create greater awareness of the need for testing. We at all times must promote early detection. We have a responsibility to make sure that our brothers and sisters and our children who are in situations of high risk are tested regularly so that they are aware of their HIV status. In 2013, Antigua and Barbuda became the first Eastern Caribbean country to host the media launch of Regional Testing Day. And this continued in 2014 with bipartisan support from both the Prime Minister and the leader of the opposition. Antigua and Barbuda stands strong with our regional counterparts as we consciously envision the possibility of reaching as many persons as possible, accessing free, voluntary, and confidential HIV testing. You can be assured that we will prioritize funding to increase the availability of antiretrovirals, 
and obviously to ensure that there's wider public education on this issue and to promote increased testing. In 2015, we were pleased to welcome St. Lucia as the newest host of the regional media launch and to return in 2016. We are indeed honored to have the engagement of the Honorable Dr. Kenny Anthony, Prime Minister of St. Lucia, and the Honorable Dr. Gail Rigabat, Leader of the Opposition, both giving statements of commitment to this initiative in particular and HIV efforts in general. I wish to commend the partners, the stakeholders who continue in their fight to ensure that we correct the behavioral patterns that give rise to the imprudence that breeds those kinds of diseases. In the next few months, the world will confirm the new Sustainable Development Goals. That is a new framework for the next 15 years. We will globally commit to an end, I repeat, an end to HIV and AIDS in this world by 2030. Coordinating a region-wide testing drive is no easy task, and this has been ably achieved through the sterling efforts of PANCAP and ministries and departments of health in each country, as well as performing artists in host countries for the regional media launch. In recent years, many of the churches in the region have embraced Regional Testing Day, opening their doors to the medical workers and counselors to offer regional testing, and this will continue this year as well as our special outreach to key populations. Thanks to God, we had... Uh people like you, the church, and um, civil movement in different places, they stand up and they say, God help us. Help us to find the way. And we have been able to create uh, activism. Regional Testing Day 2015 was a resounding success, with 16,655 persons being tested across the Caribbean. This reflects a 64% increase over results for 2014. One year short of our 10th anniversary, our goal is to have tested at least 100,000 people in the Caribbean by 2017. Are you positive? You are negative. H I V free. The Caribbean has embraced our original jingle created in 2014 when we also launched a dedicated website where you can get news and updates on testing sites as well as our Facebook page. Talent known around the Caribbean lead the campaign lending their voices to the radio and TV jingle that drives public service announcements. Joining them is a wide cross-section of Caribbean society who made it so popular that they asked us to bring it back this year. Are you positive? You are negative? Get tested and see. So here is the public service campaign that will be broadcast region-wide for 2016. Are you positive? You are negative. H-I-V free. Are you positive? You are negative. Get tested and see. Are you positive? You are negative. Are you okay? Are you positive? You are negative. Get tested today. Regional HIV Testing Day is Friday, June 24th, and free testing is available at these locations so you can know your status. In addition, free testing and counseling is available at these locations and times. A full list of testing sites can be found on the iliveup.info website. Regional Testing Day, for nine years an initiative of the Caribbean Broadcast Media Partnership, supported by PANCAP and the Scotiabank. Are you positive? You are negative. Live up today.